Hi everyone, I have a Timu haul to share with you guys. You can shop on Timu.com or in their app. And if you are a new user, I do have a coupon code. It is off4235. And if you are a returning customer in the app, there is a section which has coupons in the menu. So definitely go check that out. So whenever that comes up, I place another order. So this is not sponsored. I did pay for this with my own money. And what I did was I had a coupon for $5 off a purchase of $29 or more. So that's what we got going on here. Now, this one I did order before and it came cracked. So that bothered me. I don't like having my stuff broken. So they did refund me. It was very, very easy to get a refund. There was no problem with that. They were super nice, super easy. So this case is $1.38. And let me go ahead and open this up and I'll show you guys what it looks like. So here is the case and it has three trays and then the lid. And you just snap it open now these dividers do move so for me personally I don't like that they move so I will be gluing mine down just so that they're nice and tight in there but with this so like I said some of the pieces were broken on my last one that they shipped so I was able to salvage two of the trays so I did save it and I'm hoping that I could just snap it on and make my tower a little bit taller. That worked. Look at that. So if you want taller towers, just know that they are interlockable. So there's another little hook right here. So I could go ahead and order another set and then even make this tower even taller. So that's always an option to keep in mind. So... Now it doesn't even bother me that my other lid and my other tray got, you know, all crushed in the shipping because now I just have a little bit taller tray. So that's really, really awesome. I love that, that that worked out. And then I bought some wax spoons for my wax seals. I love making wax seals, but not going to lie, <laughs> I lose my spoon all the time. So when I'm done, I go and I clean it out in the kitchen and then who knows where it ends up sometimes. It just gets lost in there or I'll find it later like in the drawer. So like if Sunny Boy was trying to be nice and help me clean up the kitchen and put things away, he'll stick it in the drawer and then like I don't realize that it's in the drawer. So yeah, only having two spoons is just not working for me. So I ordered four from Timu because they are so cheap, but they're such, such good quality. And these were only 88 cents. These are the best price that I've seen around. Now these are different than what I have. This is kind of flat on the bottom and it's a little bit wider. So I like that. And this is definitely different than the spoon that I already own, but I'm kind of digging it. It's got like a wider mouth and then it's got the little flatness on here with a little like spout right here, little pouring area. So I like it. So I bought four. I'm so happy I bought four. Now they do have different colors for the handles but I just went with black I didn't need blue or pink or any other color that they had I'm very simple black white you know clear I'm fine with that so I got those like I said here's my other one because I did get four of those and then I got another storage container this one was only 58 cents you guys I am just dying I couldn't believe it was 58 cents so I only ordered one and now I'm regretting it I should have got more so yeah this is great let's see one two three four five six so it's a 24 little section it has the double closure which is the only kind of closure that i like that it closes on both sides so it's nice and secure and these dividers do not move that is my favorite kind of little case so yeah um i should have definitely bought more of these because for 60 cents basically <laughs> i should have just stocked up while i was there i will leave a link down below to all of these products so that way it makes it really easy for you guys to go ahead and go and find them so these flowers i actually thought were going to be smaller they're a lot larger so these are a dollar 18 but you do get a variety of roses so i was hoping to get um i bought the mix pack you could buy just by the color but i was kind of hoping for like a lot of red and you know possibly white because I wanted to use it for my Alice in Wonderland junk journal that I want to make 
but that's okay. I still like all the colors. I'm super happy that I got the blue. You guys know me and my blue roses. So these are really, really nice. I gotta say that these are probably like an inch or an inch and a quarter. So they're a really good size. They are very 3D, very, very beautiful. And then it does have some glue dots for you. So that was really cool that they included the glue dots. So that was a very nice little find right there for $1.18. Now I did get these beads right here. These were $1.34. There are 50 and I gotta say that these look a lot different online. So online they look like very bright. Like the blue look very blue. The red look very red. Where this pack I feel like it all just kind of blends. Like you can see you know the blue from the red but the colors are definitely more vivid online. So I'm like, it's okay, I'm still going to use them. But yeah, it just definitely looked different than the photo. But they're still really good quality and they're still really nice. And it is the size that was advertised online. So 50 pieces for $1.34, yeah, that's a win. Totally not bothered by it, going to keep that. And then I got some napkins. Not for the kitchen, I got these for decorating for my crafting. So this was $2.59 and I just thought it was a really pretty pattern. Like I said, you know, I'm going to do an Alice in Wonderland drink journal. So I'm thinking a lot of roses, you know, a lot of um, like garden stuff. So I thought these were really, really nice to go ahead and pick up. You just need a little bit of Mod Podge and just, you know, some cardstock and you can glue this down to a page and then create a junk journal. So I got that rose one. I got this one. This one too, the colors were definitely a lot more vivid online than what they are in person. But this will give it a nice little like vintage light color. And then this one is just beautiful. I love these, you know, pink roses and has a dark one to the lighter one. Very, very nice. And then you have these right here. They could definitely cut out and use as well. Oh, sorry. So let's see. This one was 99 cents. So you see, I'm not getting a blame for 99 cents. It's not as dark and as colorful as online, but it's still beautiful. So for 99 cents, that's a win. And then this one was $1.18, which is still a win. So I'm wondering if these are double plied or, you know, what's going on with these. So let's go ahead and check it out. Because I know when I usually buy them, I have to take off the back piece. And this one, I can't tell. It might just be as is oh no there is two layers here i think so usually i just kind of like rub the corner and pull them apart i know somebody else told me to use tape yeah i can't tell no these are definitely two layers there is definitely two layers so i will just have to work at this to go ahead and get that clear napkin piece off which I think I actually got. Yeah, it's really stuck. So I'll have to work with that. So yeah, I just take off the back layer and then I glue it onto my paper. And then let's see the last little couple items here. I got these like little doll stickers. So these were a dollar forty-eight. And I think there was 50 pieces in here. Yeah, it doesn't say. But these are just like little vintage dolls that I thought would be really good just for some of my, you know, like Victorian old vintage little junk journals. Like I have so much ideas of what I want to do. So I just thought this would be really nice to have on hand. Just a bunch of these little ladies here. Oh, she's cool. She's pretty. Oh, there's a little boy in here. So yeah, these are really nice. Super happy that I picked those up because I do have a couple of ideas on how to go ahead and use those. And then my last two items are stamps. And like I said, you know, I want to do the whole junk journal thing. So, you know, you think of something new you want to try, you just start stocking up on a bunch of stuff. So that's basically what I have here with these stamps. Let me open this up so you guys can see. So I love like postage stuff. So I was like, this is right up my alley. This was $1.68. So that's what this looks like. I don't have anything to put behind it. We see up here has postcard, postcard, postcard. Then there's like the little line. So you, this is like a build your own postcard. Then there's a couple little lines here. 
got correspondence, address, you know, little like number, um, place your stamp here. And then there's just like some other like stamps down here. It's beautiful. It's just so, so pretty. So, you know, $1.68, that is such a good deal. And then to go with this stamp, I got this one. So this actually has like a whole postcard right here. So it's like already like a whole little message and like to and from and it's just beautiful. I love it. And then down here, you know, there's just some more like little sentiments that you could go ahead and stamp on. There's some like little numbers down here. And this one was $2.48. So really, really good finds on Timu. I absolutely love shopping on Timu. If you guys ever need any help looking for anything, please let me know. I'm always happy to help if I can. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and we'll see you later. Bye guys.